To create an adjustment for a petty cash, log in to C002 Customer Information, click Enter Go, enter your password, enter the account number, and this will display your customer account information. The customer has a balance of 7620, which is shows in red and it's negative. So this is the amount the customer is due. It could be that the customer um, overpaid on their last payment or there was a cancellation. And this is the refund the customer um, will be receiving. So to create the petty cash, click where it says adjustment. Here you will see on the adjustment screen, any adjustments that have previously been created or posted, they will show here. So this account has no previous um, adjustments that have been created. To start, you will click Add. At the top, click Form Type. Select Petty Cash, Petty Cash Voucher. Here it will show the customer's account name. I will click where it says Invoice and select the invoice that it's canceled, the last one, the most recent one. I will go ahead and click enter. And this already shows my true transaction with the refund description. I will go ahead and enter the amount of 7620, which is the amount that it's on the account. Once you enter the amount, I will go ahead and enter reason. You can just enter customer, refund on overpayment. Okay, so once you have entered your note as to um, your refund, I will go ahead and click print, click preview, and this is the receipt that will print. It will show the code that will show in the cashier site, the description, which is a refund on the account. And it's $76 with um, 20 cents, customer's account, the invoice in which the refund is being done on. Also, there's a place for the customer to sign that they are getting the refund of the 76 with 20 cents. And the person who's creating the adjustment um, to sign. So let me, I'll click escape click print and this will print the receipt that the customer and the person creating the adjustment will print. Once you've printed your your petty cash voucher it will show the invoice that is a petty cash voucher. The date that it's created, the status is just shows as created and the person created. If you need to go back and edit the the petty cash you can just click edit and you're able to make changes to your petty cash once you've made your changes just click escape or save if you made any changes in this case i did not make any changes so i just clicked escape um, you can go ahead and make any changes delete the petty cash if you need to if you're no longer making that refund maybe it's being used as a credit balance for another sale <clears throat> You can delete it as long as it is not posted. Once the status um, changes from created to posted, there is no changes that can be made. I will go ahead and click Escape. And I have created my petty cash. I will click Escape and log into the cashier screen to post my adjustment. So I will enter my cashier screen, which is 0001 Sales and Payments. I will click Enter. And this will display my cashier screen. Enter my password, customer's account number, click enter. So to post my petty cash refund, here on the cashier screen is also negative 76 with 20 cents. So I will go ahead and click where it says type, select adjustment. This is my adjustment that we just created. I will select the adjustment click enter select. Now it's showing the invoice I will be um, doing the refund on. I'm going to click show transactions and now it's showing that it's my transaction a two for a refund on account. It's the trans um, the amount of 76 
And the only thing I need to do is how am I refunding this money to the customer? If it's cash that I'm refunding it, I would just select cash or it's visa. Just select the tender type. The customer will receive um, the refund. Once you select your form that the customer will receive their, their, their refund, click print receipt. And it'll start posting your transaction. Okay, so our transaction is complete. I will go ahead and click OK. The balance now is zero. I will click activity. Scroll down and you can see the customer had a credit balance of 76 for 20 cents. We created the refund and we gave back the customer their money in cash. I will go ahead and click escape and you've completed the process of creating a petty cash and refunding it to the customer. If you're the cashier that's actually creating the, the petty cash, you would just click account and you would just click here, adjustment, and go back and do the same process. So I'm gonna, here it shows the invoice, the type of form that we created, the date, it now it shows that it's been posted in cashiers and the date that it was posted. I will go ahead and click edit. I can no longer make changes. I can just view it. It's in read status only. I will click escape, escape, escape. I'm gonna say no. And you've completed the process of creating and posting a petty cash to a customer account.